Does your Google Analytics account have a watchdog? Maybe it should. Who's looking out? Who's barking at the mailman? Who's letting you know when things are going right or wrong with your analytics? Today, I'm gonna to be talking about Google Alerts and how they can basically serve as your Google Analytics watchdog. Isn't that right? So what are Google Analytics alerts? You can find them in the Google Analytics intelligence section uh, of your account. And I care about the weekly alerts. And what these are doing is sending an email and text message to you as soon as you set up a custom little framed analytics. This is what I'm tracking. And it's gonna send you that message only when it fires. Kind of like the dog barking. Okay, Turtle? Let's tell them how to do this, okay? So before we go setting up a ton of alerts so that like go firing all the time, kind of like your dog barking every single time the bell rings, you wouldn't do that, would you? So if we don't want a bad dog, we have to answer three questions. And I want yes to at least one of these questions. First, is there a business goal that this alert is sort of keeping an eye on? Next, is this helping you do your job or someone else, helping someone else's job just perform better? And then finally, will you take action if this alert is fired? You have to say yes to at least one of those, otherwise you're gonna have a bad dog in your hands. The first example I wanna talk about is a traffic surge. So I wanna know if the traffic spike is happening this day versus last week this day. And if it's more than 30 to 50%, that means something crazy is going on. There shouldn't be that much of a difference week to week on a given day. Conversely, I also wanna know if it's dropped by 30 or 50%. So setting up this goal can really give us insight into something's going on on the site right now, let's take action, bless you. Goal completions, oh my gosh, you have goals set up on your site. I know you do because you watch these videos. We wanna know if your goal completions are going above or below 20% this day versus the last day this week. So these are people that are signing up for your newsletter, donating, volunteering, signing up for your site maybe. We wanna know if this is going up or down over, I'd say 20%. You wanna set these things up and get a sense for your own site. You can also set them up for specific exact goals that you wanna measure. We talked about goal completions. I wanna talk about goal conversion rate. This is the rate at which we turn a visitor into someone who's filled out a form, donated, or maybe taken some action on our site that's desirable. So we wanna know if this conversion rate has increased or decreased, again, by around 20%. It could be a sign that, let's say our donation form is broken. Let's say that our like newsletter's broken. That would be terrible, wouldn't it? Well, we don't want that to happen. And so, if that alert goes off saying like last week on Thursday decreased by 20%, that may mean that one of our pages is broken and we should do something. The last example is talking about bounce rate. So bounce, as you remember, is if somebody comes to just one page of your site and then immediately leaves. So let's say if you had 100% bounce rate, that means everyone came to just one page and immediately left. That'd be sad. Oh, don't leave. So we wanna set up an alert that tells us if last week we've either increased or decreased by uh, around 20%, for our bounce rate because if it's decreased by that much, that means a lot of people are leaving. That's really sad. We wanna keep, keep the people on our site. So on the topic of watchdogs, we thought this is a perfect moment to tell you about a new tool called allgoodtext.com. Allgoodtext.com sends you a weekly text message with three important metrics that you choose, either from your Google Analytics or your YouTube account, letting you know if things are all good with your data. So set up those Google Analytics alerts because a dog can be an analyst's best friend. <laughs> As always, send us questions at Whole Whale or leave them in the comments and let's watch some more videos. Watch some more videos over here and if you want to, subscribe. You may see Turtle again, maybe not, depends on if you subscribe.